Hey gamers, today we're diving into the latest GameHub 3.0.3 Android emulator update, and trust me, this one's packed with awesome new features and major bug fixes. Whether you're a fan of Steam games or love playing PC titles like GTA 4 directly on your Android device, this update is going to change your experience big time. And yes, I'll also show you how to set up GTA 4 locally without using streaming at the end, so stick around. Account login and profile page. You can now log in directly to your Steam account from the emulator. This also adds a Steam profile page, making it easier to check your games, friends, and achievements. Steam Games Library. Launch games easily. A built-in Steam Games Library allows you to download and launch your PC games directly from the emulator. No more manual imports, just log in and start playing. Local mobile games import. Now you can import and organize your mobile games within the emulator, keeping everything in one place for quick access. Mouse wheel virtual button support. A big improvement for FPS and strategy gamers, mouse wheel scrolling is now supported for virtual buttons, making in-game actions smoother. Nova 2 Lite controller support. Gamepad users will love this. The Nova 2 Lite controller is now fully supported, offering better compatibility and smoother controls. Shortcut reminders. The emulator now reminds you to create shortcuts when exiting cloud gaming, PC link streaming, or PC emulator, so you can jump back into your games quickly. Bug fixes and performance improvements. This update also comes with important fixes to improve stability. PC game icons no longer disappear after clearing downloads. Button imports now save properly without needing edits. Game sound no longer disappears when switching to background mode, fixed screen display issues in Watch Dogs, Warcraft 3, and Just Cause. For our VR headset users, especially on Pico, there was a weird bug where duplicate virtual controllers would appear. That's fixed. And a neat new feature, they added language setting support for Steam games. You can now choose your preferred game language directly from GameHub's settings. Also, if you've been dealing with lag or strange performance drops, the update includes lots of under-the-hood optimizations and fixes that make the emulator way more stable overall. All right, now let's talk about setting up GTA 4 inside the emulator without using Stream. This is something a lot of you asked for. Start by opening the GameHub app. From the home screen, tap on the menu icon, then navigate to the device section. Here you'll find the area where your PC games are managed. Tap on the plus icon to begin adding a new game. Next, locate the folder where your GTA 4 files are stored on your phone. Find and select the GTA.exe file inside that folder. Once you've selected it, GameHub will automatically begin downloading all the necessary components required to run the game. This process might take a few minutes depending on your internet speed, so just let it finish. After the download is complete, return to the home screen of the emulator. You'll now see the GTA 4 icon appear in your game list. Tap on it and then enter the game settings. In the general settings tab, you don't need to change anything. Leave all options as they are. Now head over to the compatibility settings. Here, under translation parms, change the setting to performance mode. For the GPU driver, leave it on default unless your device has a Mali GPU. In that case, switch it to system driver. Then scroll down and set the DXVK version to 1.10.3. After that, change the CPU translator version to 0.32.1, and finally set the VRAM allocation to 2GB. Once these settings are configured, you can also customize your input mapping if you prefer a specific control layout. If not, the default control scheme works well for most users. Now, go back to the home screen, tap on the GTA 4 icon again, and press play. The game should now launch and run directly on your Android device. No streaming required. While the game loads, here are a few features to get excited about. GTA 4 offers a massive open world set in Liberty City, a deep story-driven campaign with Nico Bellic, realistic driving physics, and a world full of missions, activities, and chaos. When your GTA 4 game completely opens, make sure to set all the in-game graphics settings to low for the best performance. Once done, Start your game and enjoy the smooth experience of playing GTA 4 right on your phone. So that's the full breakdown of GameHub 3.0.3's latest update, plus a full GTA 4 setup guide. This update makes GameHub one of the most powerful emulators on Android right now, whether you're into Steam, PC emulation, mobile titles, or VR gaming. If this video helped you out, smash that like button, subscribe for more emulator and game setup guides, and drop a comment if you want a step-by-step -step tutorial for other games too. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Happy gaming.